The attention of the state police command, according to the public relations officer SP Muhammad Shehu, was drawn to two separate reports bordering on security in Shinkafi local government area aired by some media organizations. There was no any abduction of school student in Shinkafi or any part of Zamfara State. That is number one. Number two, uh, the issue of saying the strength of the security agencies is grossly inadequate to the extent that only 18 policemen are in Shinkapi is completely not true. SP Shehu Muhammad, who described the reports as a calculated attempt by some mischief makers to create fear and apprehension into the minds of the citizens, urged the public to disregard them, stressing that those who engage in spreading fake news would be dealt with accordingly. We have resolved that we will not take it lightly with any person or group who embark on spreading fake and misleading information. The police spokesman who maintained that the security measures adopted by the state government are yielding positive results added that criminal activities have reduced drastically. He used the medium to call on the general public to continue to collaborate with security operatives in their effort to restore lasting peace in the state. Abduction, attacks and incessant killings of the innocent citizens have been reduced drastically. We are not arguing the fact that there are some skirmishes here and there, but not like before. NTA News gathered that the State Commissioner of Police had earlier visited Shinkafi, where he interacted with community leaders, but did not receive any report of abduction of students or attacks on some communities, rather commendation on the resilience and commitment of the security operatives in the area. In Gusau, Halliru Muhammad Umar, NTA News.